Hello everybody and welcome back to Devil May Cry 2. I'm Kurukon and thank you for joining me. And let's see, do I have money? I do not. Or not money, red orbs. Ah, eh, whatever, it's currency, it's money. <coughs> oh hey! She was kind of in a cutscene, but not really, but sort of. <laughs> bugs! I hate bugs! So, uh, yeah. Second day of recording. I'm actually running out of room on my main flash drive. So, uh, I may have to, uh, stop recording part of this until there's more room. Not really sure how much room I'm gonna be able to manage. Well, I've got two flash drives, though. The, uh, one I use for, uh, storage, <laughs> it's down to, like, less than half. Eh, hell, I should have enough. And I did not dodge remotely quick enough. Alright. This guy's not very hard, as you can see. He's kind of slow! The birds are probably a bigger threat for the most part. <laughs> Ow! I did not dodge far enough away. Amusing, uh, considering this is the uh, mission I got an S rank on as Lucia. Still don't know if I'm pronouncing that right. Okay, you know what? I I'm using my DBZ powers. Holy crap! Why did I not do that sooner? I know I keep calling them DBZ powers, but holy shit, those are DBZ powers! My attacks that do okay-ish damage... Ooh. Devil Trigger and Kamehameha! Just... Wow! And now I'm about to fight a tank. First, we'll get up here. Is this where I make a flock off feather face jokes? Jokes? Joke? I don't know, my, uh... Uh... I'm not sure what the term is there. I don't know the difference between my singular and plural nouns. Let's put it that way. I know you can't see me very well, but let me guarantee there is something badass happening over here. I don't want to be up there. Okay, here we go. This is like the easiest S rank in the game. I mean, for uh, combos. <coughs> in Dante's story, you fight like three or four of these tanks, but honestly, they're only dangerous at uh, distance. At close range, they cannot hit you, unless you're standing on them. Why, why was I doing it the long way? Huh. Well, you know, this guy actually has pretty good defense. But I have a sword. And now everyone's like, who the hell are you? That's... See? Short mission. Got a B rank. How did I get an S rank last time and a B rank this time? I probably suck. But yeah, as you can see, nothing... Nothing special. I think that's a lot of the reason why this game gets so much hate. Is it's nothing special. While the first Devil May Cry was this amazing, unique, one-of-a-kind title. I don't know why I looked. I knew I didn't have enough. <coughs> 
I mean, this is a pretty average beat em up hack and slash type game, as opposed to whatever the first one was, that weird mix between survival horror and action. Then Devil May Cry 3 is just balls to the wall insane. I'm not gonna fight you guys! I'm gonna completely uh, ignore you and run over here. <coughs> but yeah, I don't think this game deserves the hate it gets. Definitely of the mind that it's mediocre at its worst. Ow! I'll kick your ass in a moment! Alright. I'm gonna shoot the birds! Cause I hate birds. I hate birds so much they poop on everything. Ow! That was not very nice! And then I screwed it up because they went under there. I wonder if the enemies just infinitely spawn in here. Yay, free health. I think they might actually infinitely spawn. Ow! That is not okay, dude! Ow! That is not okay! Oh my god, they're still spawning! Oh my god! Yeah, I think these little bastards will just infinitely spawn. Or not. I guess that was the last one. Probably should have just ran ahead. Oh, hold on. Ooh. Yay! Power up! How do I get out? There we go. Yeah, I'm not gonna fight you losers this time. Too much of a pain in the butt, not worth the rewards. I'm just gonna dodge roll until I get out. Yeah, I know it's not the most exciting game, but there's still something I find myself enjoying about it. I don't know why. Oh, cutscene. Oh, time to abuse the devil trigger. Abuse activate! I'm just gonna ignore you guys and run away, okay? That is a cool aura. I guess, I can't remember if it was Kamiya or Itsuno or maybe even someone else. <coughs> But someone said that this might not even be Trish's actual devil trigger. So she might have a normal demon form. I'd like to see that. Hold on. Let me recharge my, uh, devil trigger. Devil trigger recharge. God, I love how fast that is. I wish I were faster. Actually, I could probably just equip the quick heart, but... Uh, I didn't mean to start flying. And here we go. Yay!
Let, let's turn off the Devil Trigger so I don't waste it. I should have kept the Devil Trigger on for these guys. Oh wow, you guys are kind of pansies against Trish, aren't ya? Yeah, it's it's an easy game. I won't pretend it's not. Although I was surprised that hard mode actually had a few parts that gave me a little bit of trouble. Not a lot, but a little. Uh. Haha, <laughs> missed. Haha, <laughs> missed. Haha, <laughs> missed. Haha, <laughs> missed. <laughs> I'm being such a piss ain't to these guys. <coughs> but uh Yeah, I get I get the uh complaints about the lack of challenge. Although I have to wonder if Dante Must Die mode is a cakewalk or not. But the game is a lot, lot easier than the others. I'd say it is pretty much the black sheep of the family, but... Well, besides the uh, reboot, anyway. But, um... I don't think that being a black sheep is necessarily a bad thing. Okay, I can't get that box because of these little turds. Then again, I'm also the guy that likes Fantasy Star 3. No, not Fantasy Star Online 3. I never played it and I heard it. That was actually bad. Like, really bad. But I know a lot of people hated Fantasy Star 3 on the Genesis. Not me, though. I like Fantasy Star 3. It's actually my favorite of the classics. I'm going to hell for that one, I'm sure. That's not to say I hate Fantasy Star, Fantasy Star 2, or Fantasy Star uh, 4. I just happen to like 3. A lot of it has to do with the multiple routes and such. And yay, pointless FMV! So, um, how did we get to an oil tinker? That is an oil tinker, right? It looks like one. And that's Arius. He's the villain. Or, supposed to be. He's not very intimidating. And with that, I'm going to end the episode here. So thank you guys so much for joining me. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope you come back for the next one.